Good morning. Welcome to Erica LOL Beauty and Reviews. I'm Erica. Um, if you're new here, welcome. Please stay to the end. If you like the video, please like it, subscribe, do all that stuff that everybody talks about doing. I prefer you do it at the end. That way, you know you like it and you'll come back. But anyways, today um, we're going to be doing like a drugstore makeup summer base you know just the base makeup with all drugstore or drugstore priced items because that's what I have out I meant to do this last week I have a little bit of a headache right now so if I I think it's allergies and there's something called um Saharan dust that's in the air here in Texas have y'all ever tried this Waterloo stuff it's pretty good. I'm giving up sodas for um, the foreseeable future. <laughs> um, I drink diet soda all the time, and I just wanted to give it up and, you know, drink more water, drink more other stuff. And so far, it's mostly like since I drink diet sodas, the aspartame and the sodium in it. I'm trying to get away from all that. So, um, yeah. My eyebrows look bad. Anyways, we're going to move on and start this whole thing. And the first thing we're going to use is the um, Wet n Wild Photo Focus Face Primer Dewy. I like to put Dewy for during the summer. Which I don't know why because you sweat outside. If you're more oily, because this stuff is really dewy. If you're more oily, I would suggest using a matte primer and do the dewiness with something else. Like use a dewy foundation with a matte primer and it'll kind of put it at a normal level for you is what I have found personally as you can see this is definitely it's not greasy as much as it's got, just got like um, a bunch of highlighty type stuff going on in it I like this new light because you could see it's more realistic all right so we got that in and then for like the pores if you want like a little bit more you could take like the um marshmallow primer by nyx or the poreless putty primer should have done this first but i could see my pores are out to play and this isn't really working since I didn't use it first. I'm guessing. But anyways, this is the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. And I, I would say put it in your T-zone. Alright, we're going to take the L'Oreal Paris um, Skin Paradise Water Fuse Tinted Moisturizer because um, it's either this or I would use the Perfusion one, uh, the Perfusion Foundation, if I wanted more coverage, as well as the e.l.f. Camo Conceal Foundation. I love that. CC stands for complete coverage or color correcting. I think it's complete coverage. Um, BB is beauty fire. It's like um the BB cream is the one that would be like a tinted moisturizer. The other one is like a more like a full coverage tinted moisturizer. But we're gonna use this um sponge I got from. I believe this is the Sonia Kaushik one. We're just going to put this on. Okay. 
And since this is a, um, I keep saying, um, I'm sorry. Since this is a tinted moisturizer, there's not a lot of, um, there's not a lot of coverage. So this will be more for when you're out and about at your house and things like that, or just running errands. You just wanted a look where you looked put together. Your skin wasn't just out there for the world to see. It's a your skin but better kind of thing that you would have going on this day. So we're just making sure we have it completely covered on the face. some across the eyes just for just for fun okay so we got that now we're gonna take some concealer we're gonna use the wet n wild incognito the other one I have out for this is um is the pretty fresh one which I think is the one I actually wanted to use but I saw this one first so We're going to use our fingers to do it first. I have a migraine happening right now, so it's kind of fun sitting in front of lights. That is so funny. Can you see that thumb? No primer, primer, and foundation. I think I already mentioned I had a headache. I am. But when I look straight at the lights, the headache gets worse. So I guess that's why I keep mentioning it. Alright. So we got the, the concealer on. Now we're going to take this Wet n Wild stick. Since this is all drugstore, we're going to take this. And we're going to put a little bit on for the contour type things it more or like more or less kind of warms the face up more than contours because this is not the right contour color so this is a bronzy type color I would say I'm using the top of the same sponge to blend it out what have y'all been watching on Netflix we have Netflix Discovery Plus Disney Plus and Hulu that came with our phones that comes with our phone plan we got rid of cable and only kept internet and because it was cheaper to keep the internet and then just um Okay, we were paying almost $350 a month for cable, internet, and all that. So, we went from that to around 100 for just the internet and the phone. And then, um, with that, you add on the things we have, and it's still only like $150. All right, so anything you watch on Netflix and stuff, see how it like warmed the face up without too much of a problem. We're going to use a little bit of this incognito because I think I made my nose too brown. Just 
just to lighten up those areas a little. We're going to use this um, Yayo. That's kind of like the Tati Beauty Sponge. This is just a small one. There we go. To brighten that area back up. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and put the powder and I love the um, Physicians Formula Natural Defense. It has an SPF of 20 and a PPF, RPF, PPF. I really have to look that up. But I love this stuff. It's my favorite powder. This is my second um, container of it. It has a nice scent to it. It's not too strong. I need to try the foundation like this because I do like this so much. Maybe the foundation is like also awesome. I saw that Tati has an all-star palette that had all the things in it. The bronzers and everything. I thought about it, but then I'm like, I need to do a declutter. We're not buying more makeup right now until after I get through these drawers. So... All right, so we got that on. Now we're gonna take the Rimmel. I love this Rimmel Natural Bronzer. Looks like that. I got this on, this is an 002 Sun Bronze. I got this on Amazon, I believe. So we're gonna take this brush first so it can be more precise. And then I'm going to take the big fluffy one that I like to use. And just kind of buff that out and then put it at the top. Alright, we got the bronzer on. And I like this. It's a dupe for the um, dandelion blush from Benefit. And I like taking it because it's a light pink, especially during the summer. And just putting it on. Lightly on the cheeks so you have that just that tad bit of pink. And then this is the Physicians form. Oh, this is in the color Baby Blossom. C12. And this is um, Physicians Formula in Pearl. I love this highlighter. So we're going to take it. And just put it on the spots that right. we want to shine. We're going to take this Hard Candy Longwear um, Sheer Envy Setting Spray. It's 12 hours. Mm. I love the Sheer Envy one by Hard Candy because it also has the hydration. And you can feel it going in. Oh my gosh, it is so awesome. I love when you can feel the hydration part of anything. If you've been here, you know that. What have y'all been up to this summer? I know this video should have come out weeks ago. Between my accident and the other thing that happened. That had me in the hospital, emergency room last week. Um. It's just been a summer, so. All right, we're going to use the Ulta Beauty Slim Brow Pencil to do our brows. And I don't plan on doing my eye makeup right now. Um, but a thing you can do if you're just running out of the house is take your bronzer 
and put it over your eyes. Like maybe just in the, let me see if I could do that. Lightly do that real quick and show you what I'm talking about. Sorry, I was concentrating on my brows. And I'm gonna sweep through this one. All right, now, what I'm talking about is you could take your bronzer and grab a, like a blending brush like this. This is a do color, I think, or do care. Or I don't know. And then just gently darken above. And it'll give your eyes some dimension without putting a bunch of a bunch of um eyeshadow on. And just lightly do it see what I mean like your eyes they get a little bit more dimension than just being the same color as your face without being too much if you don't want too much um I forgot to lay out what I wanted over here but any lip oil you can take and put on And like a nude lipstick. I don't have any lipsticks out right now. So we're going to use the um, LA Girl Ultimate Intense Stay Lip Color in Girl. Oh no. And I have no idea it's that color. It's like a nude. Go ahead and remove the foundation. And there you go. And that's just a simple run out the door look. If I wasn't talking to you, it would have took me five minutes. I did it the other day to time it before I went grocery shopping. Um, every single step except for the lip gloss um, I did. Because when I go out, actually, I still wear my mask. So I hope everyone has a wonderful Monday. And I will see you, I believe, Wednesday. I'm going to try for Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So let's make sure... I can get that done. In fact, I know there'll be a Wednesday video because I'm about to record it now. So I will see y'all soon. Bye.